Oh my god, soon I'm gonna run out of people to make fun of. Why is my sexuality a lifestyle? Why do you call it a lifestyle? Like choosing to wear a dress? He lives by the beach, that's his lifestyle. It's not really a lifestyle, it's just my life. I've never heard anyone call it a lifestyle and I've never called it a lifestyle. I've never even thought of it as a lifestyle. I really only think of it as your life. Why is it that when you find out that I'm gay, you think that I want you? Standards, first of all. Everyone has a type. You might not be their type. Don't flatter yourself. No, you don't flatter yourself. You assume that I assume that you want me. Why are you so worried about how I'm going to have kids? Why does it matter if I'm going to have kids or not? It doesn't. I really could care less. Technically, the world is overpopulated, and me not reproducing is helping you out. By participating in this video, it's like saying F you to the whole world. So if I want to have kids, um, I'm pretty sure I can figure it out. Why do you feel the need to ask who's the man and who's the woman in the relationship? Because us folk are used to men and women, you know, being in relationships, and we don't mean who is literally the man or who is literally the woman. We mean who acts more like the man or the woman that would typically be in a straight relationship. Last I checked, we were both women. That's why we're together. Both have lady parts. Please never do that again. Why do you get offended when people ask if you're gay? Because I'm not gay, I don't want to be gay, and I never want to be gay. Why would you be offended that someone thinks you're gay? I don't get offended when people think I'm straight. I mean, I kind of do. So if you kind of do, then why is it wrong for us to get offended when people think that, you know, a straight person's gay? There are worse things. How does it feel to be accurately represented in everything? So you're saying that this guy, just because he's straight and I'm straight, accurately represents me? Why, thank you. Why is it that you have such a large dating pool, but still a really high divorce rate? I don't know. Why do you have to call it a gay wedding? It's just a wedding. It's just a wedding. You know, I've been thinking while I was answering the, all these stupid questions, I don't really need an answer for them. I need a question to hit you back at with, alright? Why do you care, alright? If I call it a gay wedding, I'll call it a gay wedding. Does it affect you? No. Will I continue doing it? Yes. Is it just so you can charge us more? If two black people were getting married, would you call it a black wedding? Why do you try to set us up with the very next gay person you see? Because, I mean, some of us know that this it's harder, probably harder, to find gay people, you know, to date. So we like to try and help you out, and you guys get mad. I don't try to set you up with the other straight guy I know. We have Tinder or Grindr or... Not, what, what do you gay ladies use? Oh, we don't have one. Okay, never mind. Thank you for trying to set us up. We need help. You're welcome. Anyways, that leads us on to the end of the video. If you did enjoy, make sure you like and subscribe. And uh, that'll be all for today. Bye.